everyone, it's Lady Pops and welcome to the first of hopefully many DIY under five. That's under five minutes of me showing you an awesome DIY project that you can do at home. Today's project is a giant hairspray can inspired by the movie Hairspray. And the things you will need are a large sheet of foam, silver spray paint, a flower pot, foam noodles, blue, pink and white paper, contact adhesive and PVA glue and a pair of scissors. So let's do this. Roll your sheet of foam into a cylindrical shape and using the contact adhesive stick the sides that are touching together. Once it's completely dry, split your foam noodles down the seam and stick them on the bottom and top rim of the foam cylinder and cut and glue as needed. Then spray the bottom and top of the cylinder. Don't worry about the middle, that will be getting covered up later on. Cut a circle out of the foam which is a larger diameter than the hole in the can. Then cut a triangle from the center. Using contact adhesive, stick the sides of the cup piece together to form a cone. Lastly, stick your cone inside the can and it should start forming the shape of a hairspray bottle. Next, spray paint the outer of your flower pot. I cut a slice from a foam noodle and stuck it to the pot to make it look more like a nozzle. I was pretty proud of them at this point and the neighbours kept looking out their windows at me so I guess they're pretty impressive and not to mention huge. But remember you can do yours in any shape or size you like. I did mine sticking together three sheets of large blue paper and creating a pink paper circle to stick on top. Then using white card I copied the Ultra Clutch logo and added some 60 Styles Cosmos Stars. I made these for a company called Pop Picture House who are a monthly pop-up cinema group that show films with tons of added bonuses such as getting your makeup done, live performance, props and photo booths and so much more. If you're based in London or UK check out their Facebook, Twitter or website for more information. It would be great to see you there. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and leave a comment down below for any more 5 minute DIY ideas that you may have. Thanks.